Jeremiah 29, 11-14a says, For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, saith the Lord, thoughts of peace, and not of evil, to give you an expected end. Then shall ye call upon me, and ye shall go and pray unto me, and I will hearken unto you, and ye shall seek me, and find me, when ye shall search for me with all your heart, and I will be found of you, saith the Lord. Pastor Christian has been the pastor of Dublin West and Dublin Romanian Seventh-day Adventist Church, which according to him has been a very challenging and enriching experience. He has lived in the Republic of Ireland since 2016, and he worked with an amazing team to actively touch the lives of those around him, be it in the family, in the church, or in the community. Whilst pastoring in the Irish Mission, he was ordained and he has applied his servant leadership training to develop Adventist community services in Dublin. Also, the Discover Truth Ministry. He is passionate about leading others to expand their horizons so that we all become better servants of the Lord. Now, it's time for him to continue to serve God in his new post as elected principal for Adventist Discovery Centre. Hey, hi, Christian. Greetings from the west of Ireland. I want to wish you well as you take up your new role at the ADC. And, uh, you know, with your family as you go there, I pray that the Lord will open up different avenues for you to find a place to stay. And uh, the usual things that happen when you move. But I do wish you well. And I just want to thank you for all the work you've done here with us and the Irish Mission, and especially getting to know you. It's great fun. You're a man of a lot of energy, and I know the Lord will use you in a powerful way where you're going right now. So. Best of luck, and we'll keep you and your family in our prayers. Hi, Christian. Uh, wishing you all the best. Thank God's services you begin a new chapter in your life. May God bless you and your family and lead you. Uh, and thank you for everything your family have done for uh, not only your two churches in Dublin, but for other churches as well. I think especially about Belina Crow members and uh, for Drogheda members who have definitely been inspired and motivated and uh, empowered by your ministry in Dublin. Um, so thank you very much for that. Something uh, on the personal note, I still remember three years ago when I started my ministry here in Ireland, uh, when you, it was Sunday, um, you collect, collected me from Blessman here and brought me to Tala shopping center um, to buy a sim card and so, to see about internet so i, I uh, it was just a few days when i uh, moved here so thank you so much for that and thank you for helping me at the start of my ministry i really appreciate that so again may god bless you and lead you and um, abundantly bless you and and uh, may you experience um, his hands in your uh, in, in the new chapter of your life and your ministry. Take care. Hi Christian, greetings to you. It was a surprise to hear about your imminent departure from us here in Ireland. But we realize, you know, we're on the master's business and we have to be ready to go wherever he calls. But you know, it was a pleasure for us a pleasure for Joan and, and myself and Rebecca to rub shoulders with you and Claudia and Iris. Uh, it was a real pleasure, though we know that it was a brief encounter that we had with you. But though brief, you know, it was significant and important to us. We really appreciated your family. Thank you for the opportunity to rub shoulders with you. Thank you for sharing yourself with us as a team and the Irish mission. And now here it is that the Lord has called you on to serve a much wider community. And so we pray that God will be with you as you prepare to depart from us here in Ireland and relocate in England. And may God be with you as you uh, minister to the people there 
as you take up your work there with the Adventist Discovery Center there in England. I just want to pray that the Spirit of God will be with you, that he will go with you, that God will bless you, that God will prosper you, for after all, he called you there. He saw this from the very beginning. So may God bless you, Christian. May God bless you richly and go with you and your family. Hi, Christian. Uh, all the best as you take on this uh, new role as principal and director of the uh, Adventist Discovery Center in the British Union Conference. Uh, we will be praying for you and your team. Uh, a verse that comes to mind as you take on this new role, Galatians 6 verse 9, And let us not grow weary while doing good, for in due season we shall reap if we do not lose heart. God bless. God bless. Have you pushed the button? Oh, hi Christian, hi Claudia, hi Iris. It's been nice to get to know you over the last few years. Uh, we've been both here since 2016 together. Um, we know that things are going to change for you guys now, so we want to wish you the best. Uh, we want to wish you God's blessings in your new endeavour together even though I know you'll be living here in Ireland for a little while longer. Um, but may you enjoy what the future holds for you. God bless. As you leave the Irish mission to take up your position at the Advent Discovery Centre, I just want to tell you, Christian, that we're going to miss you and your family. Thank you for the way you welcomed me here to the Irish mission and for your support and encouragement. I know that uh, our churches have really appreciated your work with the communications department, with your um, desire to share God's Word and with the work you're doing there with uh, community services and encouraging us there. And I know that uh, you and your family have truly blessed those that you come to contact here. As you prepare to move, I just want to wish you all the best. May you and your family uh, have a smooth transition. I pray that as you move that uh, God will take you and use those gifts and talents that you've shown here and use them in a different position. So we're going to miss you. I'll miss you, and I know that all of us will. But we wish you all the best, and we truly pray that God would bless you, that God would lead you, and that God would use you and your family as you take up this new role. God bless. The Great Advent Movement is on again, and we're wishing you well, Christian, in your new responsibilities. Thank you for accepting the call and may God bless you in your new venture, in your new ministry as you lead and direct God's work at the ADC for um, the British Union. God bless you and your family as you serve. Hey Pastor Christian, thank you so much for being one of the greatest inspiration that I can look up to. Your work ethic, your passion for the people, and your deep, audacious faith in God really moved me and made me to ask questions to myself, Jeff, can you be like Pastor Christian? <laughs> you know, thank you so much for the support that you gave me as a new intern in this Irish mission. We really gonna miss you, I'm gonna miss you. I wish I had more time to sit and learn from you. But you know, by God's willing, we will learn. And I'm gonna learn from you. And may the Lord be with you and take care of you and give you all the success in the new role that you're taking and especially may the Lord be with your family who has been your greatest backbone that I ever witnessed. Take care of yourself sir and have a wonderful year. We're going to miss you. I would also like to take this opportunity to wish our colleague uh, Pastor Christian Sergiano and his family, his wife Claudia and their daughter Iris, God's blessing and his leading in this new chapter in their lives. Uh, we want to thank, thank them for their ministry during these uh, past few years here in the Irish Mission and uh, for all the projects that he's uh, initiated and been part of and we pray that the Lord will bless them accordingly. Uh, we, we, we know that this is not uh, the end of our partnership. We'll hear more about uh, the Adventist Discovery Center and the projects. Now we have a connection there and we pray that this partnership will continue under the Lord's blessing. Uh, may the Lord continue to lead, as we said, and we entrust them into His care. Go, stand, 
Speak to all the people, all the words of this life. Acts 5, 20.